All right, guys, today's that day. Welcome uh, here with um, both our contestants and Rhino. Uh, we are getting ready for the potentially last two matches. Could be one, depends on how fast Python puts it away or if he puts it away at all. Okay. This has been yeah. a long bracket. I'm glad I can have the whole thing on screen here because, wow, there's a lot to look at. Hell of yeah, a journey. Look back at some of the people that have been in this tournament. Some some big names, you know, Don Cara, um, Viz somewhere on the board, and I'm missing him. Like, there's some really talented players that did not make it this far, and we're left down with just these two, Mr. Sir and Python, who have already played each other once this tournament, um, with things going Python's way, but they're back here in grand finals, and I'm really excited. I've been looking forward to this all week. Mm -hmm. I've been looking forward to it for a long time. Um, what I will say about this match is it will not be dashless. Not this one. <laughs> yeah, if we're doing colors this time. Yeah. <laughs> this will be interesting. I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> um, yeah, but only because Python would have no damage. Well, yeah, we're going to take another two, three minutes to let a couple more people show up, and then we're actually going to get started and wrap up this whole tournament. And that's all I can really say. I'll see you guys in a minute.
Guys, it is that time. We are getting started. Python versus Sir. The final round or two starts now. How's everyone feeling? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Hi, I'm your Rhino Feeder casting the finals. Um, Hello. Yep. Sir on the left, Python on the right. I hope everyone's ready and excited. Why am I not worried? Yeah. Ready and All right. I think it's time. We'll be ready to reveal the board. Yep. Anything you guys want to say before we get started? I hate Python so much. Oh, yeah. Sure, I'm so happy I won't have to see you ever again after this one. Woo! Hey, there's always the next round. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> All right, All right. thank you for the prediction, whoever put it up. All right, well, you guys know the drill. Let's reveal the board. Okay. Let me no. know your top left squares. Okay. Deep nest tag. Deep, Deep nest tag. All right. I'm going to count you down to the deaf and you, and you can get started. All right. Three, Alrighty. two, one, go. Good luck. All right. Are they both muted now? Yep. They are both muted, deafened. All right. So we got. Oh. We're good. Okay, there we go. Yeah, so let's take a look at this board here. Um, but before we look get too much looking at the board, I want to talk about how hype this match is going to be. Like, these are you know, the two runners that have made it the farthest in the tournament. Obviously, we're in grand finals here. For anyone who doesn't know, um, because Python is coming from the upper bracket and Mr. Sir from the lower bracket, to win grand finals, Mr. Sir needs to win two matches. So Python's got a bit of a cushion here. That is his reward for being the top player throughout the tournament, but doesn't necessarily mean he's going to win. We've seen in other tournaments, players can come from the lower bracket and string together two incredible matches to take a, take grand finals. It's an interesting board. Yeah, definitely. And one thing to note already is, I, was it Mr. Sir or Python? I saw one of them went and got the Geo Rocks underneath. Uh, Python it was. Yeah. Went and got the Geo Rocks under the, the collapsing floor. We don't really, don't really see that often. I'm not really sure what the... Um, he's the only one who does it. I don't know why. Okay. Yeah. Yes, rematch will be today if it is today, or if it's necessary. Yeah, if a rematch is necessary, we've decided probably like a five, ten minute break after this match, just to let the runners and us on commentary get catch our breaths, refill water, use the restroom if we need, whatever, and then we'll do the the second match immediately following. Mm-hmm. See, I don't know why Python does that geodepot. I feel like it's slower. So I guess the I'll only say this. thing is the gom cycles don't get messed up. As someone, so yeah, that's I was gonna say. As someone who has labbed that intensely for low percent, um, you low percent, uh, like one or two times I gave it a shot. Um, <laughs> but there, yeah, it, it's it's about the same on average, but the gom room is faster. Like if you know how to handle the gom cycles, it's it's just straight up faster. Mm hmm. Mr. Sense. Sir knows what he's doing. Yeah. Keep in mind, there's delay, so they're and it's, probably it's more geo more than too. Even. It's it's a lot more geo to do the gom rocks. Um, yes. Well, I mean, it's five more geo, but this early in the game, five geo is quite a big deal for getting that stag. Yeah, it, it depends on how tight you expect geo to be throughout a run, I guess. De definitely, yeah. Um, so yeah, center board. I always like to call out the key squares on the board. First off, the center square, we got glowing woo and grimchild. Um. Not something either player can grab early. Deep nest stag, maybe we see a, some some dark deep nest going on. Kalo Zote in the top right corner. <laughs> we always love seeing that. Um, Dream Gate on the board. And the, okay, here's an early goal we might see one of the players go for is VK into MMC. What are your thoughts on this board, OJ? I think both are going to play as safe as possible and are going to be trying to get towards Crystal Heart, which is scary when you know your opponent's going to do it, but. We were also saw Sir, at least before this match, was practicing some, uh, what was it, Cliff's movement. So we okay. could see him just rushing middle square with Glowing Womb, Grimchild. We all know that the fireball skip to get to Grimchild isn't that bad. Not fireball, spike tunnel. Yeah, and one thing I'm noticing, I don't really see, and I see Mar Markoth, I guess. But I don't really see any other Dream Warriors or Dream um, bosses on the map to pair with that dream gate synergy yeah it is kind of ugly the only thing you can really do with it is um an excuse to go get wings you know go fight Loskin. 
Right, yeah. Yeah, it's always good when you can pair that with other goals at the same time, but not really looking like the case here, unfortunately. Pretty awkward board. Um, I'm excited to see how they play it, though. Yeah, we've got... Uh, I'm looking for... Uh, we do have buying out Lag Eater in row one, column two. Yep. Deep Nest Tag. Maybe a board where people would want some Geo here. Um, see, Heavy Blow Steady Body. Shade and Gigi's Hut. I know something you're a fan of with the eggs. <laughs> So are they both going die bro? It looks like it, yeah. Um, I can't imagine another reason they'd both be grabbing uh, City Crest and, and the Geo. Uh, I see Fluke Nest on here. I know I saw some other dive goals. I'm just surprised they're both going for it. Yeah. Kill two Soul Warriors? That'd be exciting. Kill two Soul Warriors is there, yeah. Um, trying to, Crystal Heart is a goal itself. I hadn't seen that before. CG2 is there. So, you know, maybe, maybe you need wings for that unless you're going to do a Cursed Shade Skip. Very risky cursed shade skip, but we could see it. Um, well, true done, but I mean, technically yeah. gets you two soul warriors when you come back. Uh, CG2 has no real bearing on dive because it's faster to get there with lantern either way. Yeah, definitely. I, uh, I got to be honest. I don't really see a ton of like great synergy here yet. I know this I'm not is... the most experienced bingoer, but it's a weird board. No, you're, you're right. Me. There's not a ton of synergy. It's kind of spread out. There's a little bit of waterways, a little bit of some other shit. But what Th I will this say... This is your kind of board. <laughs> I think this is a board where lines are extremely dangerous, where yeah. everything is spread out. There's no easy groupings or bosses. You need to be very careful of what's in what rows. Yeah, definitely. Don't want to get... Uh, a sneaky bingo give up a sneaky bingo to your opponent on a board like this yep i do like seeing hive knight on the board too always uh, always cool to maybe see some hive action going on yep i don't think it's absolutely horrible on this board yet actually either with uh yeah. save three waterway grubs and deep nest stag it's just kind of you know it's it's a goal defeat Carlos out. there's some synergy with it yeah for sure both players do get soul catcher not a surprise um I would expect us to see going to Hornet now. I think the, the next thing to really look for is I imagine both players will kill Vengefly King right away. More curious to see if either goes right for MMC after getting Dash. Because yes, that would delay the routing to get to Dive if, if our assumptions are correct that they're both going to go to Sanctum. However, that is a corner square. It's very valuable to have. Yes. I think Python got two one spits as well. Mr. Sir gets a one spit there as well. Nice. I hope Mr. Sir is lagging a bit, but either way, we got Python heading into Green Path now. I wouldn't really expect any deviation from the standard route. Just I don't think there's I don't think there's any geo either player needs to go out of their way for. I don't think there's um, any extra collectibles we need to see. We should see what Vengefly King. You said VFK Moss, Moss Charger? Yeah. yeah. So they'll both kill the, VFK plus the Zote goal. Um, right. The only thing I guess we need to worry about is are they going to do Moss Knights as well, which I doubt. Yeah, I don't. I, it's it's a lot of extra time and risk for Geo, but I don't really think... Th this doesn't seem like a super Geo heavy board to me that you would need to go that out of your way, especially in the early game where mistakes yeah, are so exactly. much more magnified. I completely agree. Yeah. Plus, they both got yeah. False Knight chests, so they're 200 above. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh that's Mr. Rough. Sir, that hurts. Good thing he didn't shoot the second fireball, though. Okay, his backup yeah. setup, getting him where he needs to be. Had he fired all three the first time, he probably would hit it. Yeah, and, and this is something hype to talk about. Like, we, we've seen a lot of players in this tournament come from different backgrounds. Some players come from rando backgrounds, some from speedrunner backgrounds. Um, and we've seen how that can help. Like, obviously being very fast can help you beat your opponent to goals. Having good rando and bingo knowledge can help you with routing and whatnot. But these players, oh my both God, of them are... Yeah, I know, he's got to chill. But both of these players are both really good runners and, like, bingo minds. And obviously that's why they <laughs> made it to grand finals here. But it's just going to be a really high-octane match, I think. And Mr. Sir losing a lot of time here to Python, having to heal twice not what you want yeah he's got to collect some soul here okay he's got enough there's the vfk kill from python very good lantern route is faster as goriel 
Yes. If you're worried about what's fastest, just always think any percent because that's them just bare bones get everything they need to win. Yeah. So for C hard at least. Yeah. That said, I can totally understand why they might want to go dive here. Um, to be fair, I don't think it would have been a terrible play for either player to just rush to um, to rush to C heart like the um, the any percent ish way. We we saw Mr. Sir in his match against you like had a really really strong route to get a crazy early C heart. Yeah. I wouldn't have been surprised to see that here too. I mean, I feel like there's something we're missing. There's no reason they'd both kill False Knight if they weren't going to go for a dive or if they didn't see something we didn't see. Yeah, well, that that's why we're sitting here commentating and they're playing in Grand Finals, right? <laughs> exactly that. <laughs> yep. <laughs> yeah. So either way, even, even with the delay from Mr. Sir's stream, I still think Python's quite a bit ahead. Um, Python had a really clean green path and Mr. Sir... Had to stop and heal twice, took a lot of hits, missed the first uh, fireball skip in green path. Mm -hmm. Not a bad Hornet, though. Yeah, really good Hornet fight. All right, so Python heading down to Fungal now. I always, I'm always curious to see if either player decides they want to buy the, um, or not buy, but fight Ogres for the extra charm notch. Don't really think so. Not, That's I don't a see any situation comeback here. later goal, because odds are you're going to yeah, go back for the Fungal notch anyways. Yeah, absolutely. Um, how much money do you need again to completely buy out Leg Eater? <laughs> I don't know. I lost my last match not knowing. <laughs> yes, yeah, you, you were like like 10 GO short or something I crazy. I think I, I was 60, exactly. if I can remember correctly. It was something real small, yeah. Enough that Ogres was enough, but it wasn't fast enough. -y. Yeah. Very nice movement on this drop from Mr. Sir. Python making his way down through oh. the big room into the Epogo room. Oh, Mr. So Mr. Sir is going to go fight Ogres. Interesting. Maybe he wants the Geo. Does... You can't buy out Slag Eater now, can no. you? No, no shot. Yeah. Because it's 86. Not even close. Yeah. I wonder what he's getting this Charm Notch for then. I mean, that just It's a lot of time. Oh, Python missed Epogo. Yeah, that's that's a that's something. Not going to miss it twice, though. Yep. Very well done. Mr. Sir collecting his soul in preparation for Epogo coming up in a few rooms. We'll see how Python does with Mantis Pogo here. Very well done. About what you Very expect nice from Python. Down. Yeah, absolutely. Now, here's where he probably goes straight up through left side city. Left side city or to MM? Oh, no, he, he, he already, neither of them went for MMC already. We're... We're well past that point. Yeah, um, MMC is a later goal. Yeah. I, I will say that I have seen players go for it right after Hornet. I'm not sure if that's a good play, but I've seen it. It really depends on the board. If you're going to press it for a line and there's a lot of synergy going through, like maybe Queen Station, King Station as well, Howling Wraiths, yeah. that kind of stuff, it can be worth it. Makes sense. And Python doing exactly what we expected here. I'm going to do... Um, Left, go into left side city. I'd expect to see a dive rush there. There hasn't been too much difference in these players routing. Um, I'm curious to see how Mr. Sir justifies killing ogres, which is quite a bit of time loss when both players are so so close to each other in terms of their pacing. Mr. Sir, did, did Python get that journal on his way out? I don't know, honestly. Yeah. Mr. Sir grabs it. My favorite journal. Um, <laughs> <laughs> if I had to guess, I would honestly guess that Sir is panicking a little bit and saw the goal on the board and decided just grab the notch. Uh, what goal is on the board, sorry? Th three notches. Oh, three notches, gotcha. Yeah, you know, I don't hate that then. Okay. I don't think it's a terrible play. Yeah, Python already at Raptors here. Mm -hmm. Oop, misses the Pogo. There you go. Good recovery. Python has such a lead at this point. Keep in mind, there's a little bit of delay. I don't know exactly how much Sir Stream likes to lag. They could be a lot closer than we think they are. I kind of right. doubt it, but... Yeah, it's hard to say. I mean, I think Python's definitely ahead. Just assume... If we assume they both played at the same exact skill level, you know, little things add up. Like, Mr. Sir had to stop and heal twice. He went out of his way and got the journal, which I don't think Python got. Yep. Um, he fought ogres, so I just don't see any way where he's ahead of Python right now. 
But it's bingo, not speed running, and there's a whole lot of game left to be played. Yep. We're gonna see One Python. thing I would, yep, go I would say I'm go certain, ahead. almost, is that we're going to see Python go to Ismos. Because he always does, and there's actual synergy yeah. there. <laughs> That's basically yeah. all I can say. He'll go do Emilitia probably as soon as he can. It takes a hit there. You don't want to be taking hits going into Sanctum, no matter how minor. And yeah, he's just going to go straight up to, 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 to Soul Master. Oof. He did not hit the... Yeah, he, he can only hit that from underneath unless you have yep. Dash Slash. Oh, okay. Ooh. Two HP Python's... going in here. No heal. This could be a moment for Mr. Sir to start making up some time. Okay. He's going to oh, heal God. here. If you have to... Yeah, you, you got to take this heal. Yep. Yep. We do have 20 grubs on the board, so it makes sense for both players to go take the one and a half second out of their way to get that grub. Oh, Python, just skip the lever skip and go. Yeah, just go. <laughs> At a certain point, right? No. Mister. Okay, he just he accidentally came up through the little transition left. I can say something about this match. I've not been able to say for any of the other matches, and that's that I am actually rooting for someone. What is Mister. Sir? Is, sir. Whoa, 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 whoa! Is he What's going he the vanilla doing? way for the Soul Warrior? I don't know if I love this. Usually, you just get it on the way out with. Um... Right. That's my thought. I don't know. But I guess he wants to... Okay, I, I don't hate it. I don't love it, but I don't hate it. I just don't see the benefit. Yeah. Let me elaborate before people think I'm just corrupt. Uh, the only reason I'm rooting for Sir here is because I love Bingo, and I would love to see a second match. Oh, That's same. the only think, reason yeah. that I can actually pick someone I want to root for. Yeah, no, I, I love both of these players, but I, I'd be saying the exact same thing about Python if he were coming from the lower bracket. Exactly. Yeah. All right, so Python, well into the Soul Master fight here. Mr. Sir heading into Hell Room. We'll see how he manages with that. Don't think any player will pick up Soul Twister. Not really a reason to on this board. Yep. I mean, it's I... nice to have for fights, but Shaman. I still guess I just Ooh. can't oh, see. Oh, Python what makes... on one health. He'll be fine. You say that. I do. He probably will, but you never know. This can be... Okay. Oof. Sir's right behind him at this point. Python took a lot of damage in Sanctum, where Sir did not... He yeah, had a Python's... really rough Sanctum. Yeah, Mr. Sir is looking a little more experienced with this part of the map in terms of taking damage and what he's doing. And keep in mind, Mr. Sir also stopped to get that Soul Warrior, so he made up, I think, probably a bit of time here. That Soul Warrior plus the Charm Notch plus the um, Journal, he spent a lot more time doing other things than yeah. python did he's right there yep and he's right there so i feel like the time he's made up is less from like the actual time loss that he's had in his play but all from his actions if that makes sense like yeah, his choices I, yeah the only time loss he really had was again the two heels in green path which you know that's python's done more than that at this point and then missing the um, the one fireball skiff, which he backed up <laughs> extremely quickly. I just realized how close they actually are, because Python still has to kill the second soul or the soul warrior, unless he skips it and comes back to it later. He skipped the seal here too. He is what hard rushing yeah. peaks. Yeah, I think he wants to hard. I think he wants to get crystal hard on the board like immediately. Every time I try and call one of Python's actions, I'm wrong. So I'm I'm just yeah. watching intently. And, and Mr. Sir probably knows with his routing that I'm giving, like, he probably knows I'm giving up priority on Crystal Heart right now. Like, I'm I'm gonna just not worry about it. I mean, it, it always seems like no matter what, how bad of a spot he's in, he just, he, he has a full comprehension and understanding of the situation. It, it's actually pretty impressive the way his mind works in bingo matches. But mm -hmm. Python as well. And Python is a very aggressive player. He knows he's very fast. He likes to pu push his advantage. And I'm excited to see what he decides to do here. He's going to go over to the left side. Yeah, he'll go up through this way and grab the key. That's for sure. Yeah, definitely. Especially with water. Maybe this is why board. they like the dive route as well. I never mm -hmm. realized how much synergy you get from the uh, Kill Your Shade and Gigi's Hut. Because you can just right. grab a key right here and not spend money. Yeah, for and sure. We've talked about how many eggs you can get. Mm hmm. Yeah, and Mr. Sir can leave here now, not needing to fight. Um, did Python fight the Soul Warrior? I don't know. 
I thought I think he lapped out the the bottom way. And Did Python also Yeah, Python didn't grab the key either. So he he's like he wants Seahart now. <laughs> yeah, um, and uh, I that think honestly he's, That's like surrendering know. a goal. Yeah. To be honest. <laughs> if Sir grabs it, it's his. Yeah. Skipped key, skipped soul warrior. Is Mr. Sir is gonna grab the key? Yeah, you know Python's going through the progression a lot faster. I think Mr. Sir is doing a better job prepping goals right now. Yeah, that's the thing. Like, is Python gonna get to see heart first? Almost definitely. How? Where's yeah. he going? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, he, I, oh, did he miss? He, um, yeah, you 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 have to dash into the room. You can't just um, D dark right when you walk in. Yeah, oh yeah, it's not dash. like the D dark room. Right, yeah, D dark. You can just spam D dark as the transition is happening, but not that room. He's gonna get an egg though. So th so this is weird. He gets an egg, telegraphing. I want Gigi's hut, goal, but didn't get the key. Yep, and that's just inconsistencies in play that will lose you matches. If you're gonna yeah, prep a goal, full prep the goal. I don't know. Yeah, I I just I don't understand it. I guess it's not horrifically slow to go back and grab it but if it's a difference between it's not fast yeah <laughs> mr oh. sir going okay yeah yeah let's see how clean his peaks is he's gonna go save this grub too python having some nope mr sir decided he doesn't want to save the grub yeah i, I again i know python's in all likelihood going to get the crystal heart goal, but I kind of like Mr. Sir's position better. He's not going to grab the egg, though. Sir has an advantage on Geo and... Oh. Sorry, I just looked at the board for the first time in a while. Is Sir going to be, like, hard prepping column two or something? With all the money, heavy blow, steady body, kill your shade, GG's hut, three notches? Yeah, you know what? He could. Again, I'm just I'm surprised he didn't grab the egg there when he well, um you can buy one down. from Sly. So it's yeah, not the true, end of the world. Like, I don't know if it's if it's yeah, it's not the end of the world, but I would have just grabbed it while you're right there. <laughs> well, it's, Python's it's free. already in C dash room. Yeah, Mr. Sir getting this relic here. Nice. Oop. At what point is he over prepping Geo? I don't oh, know, but Python? Python's on one health here, and the cycle's off now. Like, he's got to be careful. Don't go, don't go, don't Yeah, he's oh fine. my god. Yeah. I keep saying that. It's going to get someone killed. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> oh my god. Python is putting on a show for us at this point. Well, that's what we're looking for. And that's what, that's what, that's why we're here. We want It's grand <laughs> finals, and we demand content. <laughs> Oh, he's staying? D-Dark, probably? Probably D-Dark, yeah. Did he get no, Shopkeep Key? He has to have. So I, gotta be, I gotta be honest. What are we getting D-Dark for here? Watcher Knights? I would definitely not get D-Dark here. Dive yeah, out like, where you're this... gonna have extra money to spend on Elegant Key. Go get Shade yeah, like, Soul with the... And get the Shade two you gotta Soul fight warriors. the warrior anyway, yeah. yeah. I would also skip I, I, I don't. Well, we'll see what Mr. Sir does here before I say I like his routing better, but I'll also make... Oh, Python t Python's got to be careful. He's playing really aggressive here. He knows he's ahead because he got C the Seahart goal first. And honestly, I think that it almost favors Mr. Sir because he's like, okay, cool. I know exactly where you are. You have no information on me. Mr. Sir is going to stay here too. What do they see that I don't? Well, yeah, I mean, save I the know. grub at least. No, nope, not even gonna save the grub there. Okay. Oh, Python, Python do not die in dark, dark room. room. At this point, I don't know out. why. Skip it, man. Skip it. It's not worth dying here. Why did neither player get the grub in Sea Heart Room too? Am I crazy? Like, wouldn't that have been a really easy I... um grub to grab? I mean, I skip grub goals because counting to twenty is really hard, but. I mean, if you're going for right. it. Python does make it through eventually here. Yep. But and if, look how if, if much Mr. time Sir has made up. Yeah. 
Oh Jesus. I don't I don't know the way they're doing the way they're doing dark room is not how I do it, but it mm. works. I do baby <laughs> strats and I love it. Yeah, honestly, if, if that's what you know, just do it. Yeah, the way I do it is you you literally never get let go of right and just dash every chance you get. It's and you have to have some precise jumps, but what, you maybe mean a little risky for a bit. Or dash. Oh wait, Mr. S Whoa, 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 here's a big difference. Uh, oh, Mr. Mr. Sir, Sir going... skipped it and went for Dream Nail. Well, I guess that's okay, fair. I... That's fair. I gotta be okay. Oh, I was talking about the dark room though. Like you just. Oh, Python. You just jump dash over and over and never let go right, but. But anyways, I I gotta be honest. I like Mr. Sir's route choice a lot better here. Like yes, Python it. Like we're up, they're essentially near the same spot. I would imagine Python to fall into um to fall into resting grounds now. Otherwise, he would have quit out. Yeah, exactly. But Mr. Sir's got so much better prep on him. He's got better Geo. Mm -hmm. He's got a simple key. Um, I mean, what else is he? Here's the one thing. He's better prep. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to disagree. I, I like how it looks for Mr. Sir right now. However, yeah, it, execution matters a lot. He's got to go right here to the next goal he can get, which what probably Shade and Gigi's hut. Shade and Gigi's hut makes a lot of sense. I wouldn't be surprised to see him grab um, grab Shade grab Shade Soul, and get the two kills on the Soul Warriors. Mm -hmm. Or fragile heart, greed, strength. It's an er weird goal to go for early. Yeah, and he's gonna go. Yeah, he's gonna go get the stag here. Probably to. Well, he has FC, but I would imagine this to be a dirt myth. Yeah. The FC. Oh nope, FC. It is FC. All right, what are we doing here? Um, steady, buddy. That's what he's getting. Ah uh, yes. God, I hate being wrong. Or is he getting glowing wound? Oh yeah, that's a better play. Forgot that was on the board. Sometimes you yep, look at the glowing. middle square all game, and then you forget it's on there. Yeah. Interesting. Python has dream nail now. I'm I'm excited to see where he decides to go. Because again, like if this was a boss heavy board, I could see yeah maybe you go get D dark, but he got um, elegant key too, didn't he? Or shopkeeper's key, excuse me. I Python so. did. I can't imagine Python would skip it. There's rarely a reason you skip it. Yeah, and that's on a on a board this free of bosses, I guess. I don't know. I I like the Shade Soul play a little better, but who knows? Maybe they see something. Maybe Python sees something we don't. Yep. Mister Sir, gonna finish off glowing womb room here. Cool. Python back in storerooms. He's grabbing the key. He's gonna he's, do Shade Juju. Uh, yep. And this is what we're talking about, like. Sir took the time to prep it. Now he's gonna get sniped on it, yeah. Better to die there, Python. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> it actually is. No, yeah, definitely better to just take the death there. Alright, well, he's gonna get the first two goals, and Sir is gonna get the middle square. Grim child. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, Python should have just uh he should have just died when he picked up the key. It's not going to matter, ultimately, because he's going to get the goal, but, you know. Small little optimizations like that might make all the difference in, in a race between two players both so skilled. Uh, Mr. They Sir really forgets how to jump off the wall. Oh, yeah, they, they add up a ton. Um, okay, there's Python's death. I imagine he will see hard on over to GG, get yeah. that goal. Do you think Mr. Sir fights Gorb here? <laughs> you you got any... us. Uh, I would skip personally, but Dreamgate maybe. Okay, that, that's my thought. Is just the Dreamgate because there's not really any like we talked about. There's no real synergies with Dreamgate. But yeah, he just wants to go get Grimshot, get that center goal on the board. He could also go get Joni's Dark Room, which would be pretty sick. I don't expect to see he it. Could. I mean, hey, it's Grand Finals. Anything can happen. <laughs> That would make this uh, play a lot more strong. Why is Kill Your Shay and Gigi's Hut not marked on our unified board? There it is. Okay, I just took a sec. Yeah, my fault. Weird. No, it's all good. I set up to have Discord in full screen as well as oh, no, on you're accident. Fine, you're fine. So I just have to alt tab every time they mark a goal. No, I, I, I didn't know if it was automatic or not. All right, Mr. Sir, gonna go get Grimchild here, marking that center board. 
Behind in a goal now, but I still like some of his prep. He, I, I again, I keep forgetting how much money you need to buy out Leg Eater, but that's an option too. Um, yeah, having that center square, especially with all but one of the paths open, just gives him a lot of pivot power. It does. Here. Well, Mr. Sir still hasn't saved Sly. Neither has Python. I imagine that's what he's doing down here now. Oh, and gonna get Steady Body. Oh, gonna get Shaman. We'd like to see that. All right, and there's Glow Glowing Womb Grimchild for Mr. Sir. And we've got a match going here. Oh, man. So, does Sir go straight to Elegant Key is my question. Probably not. He's going to FC. I'm curious where he wants to go from It's here. gotta be Steady Body yeah. here. Which he's gonna get sniped on. Yeah, he's gonna get sniped hard on this. Um... Oh wait. He's going for elegant key. Okay. What is oh, if Python takes both soul warriors before Mister Sir, that is kind of crushing. If I'm being honest. Mhm. Mm he does need Sly. Yeah. Um. Oof. I'm starting to like Python's position a lot now. Yeah, because if he gets Shade Soul first, like there's like he can just run over and really quickly kill the second Soul Warrior, and that's two Soul Warriors for him. No, not until he kills the first one, because he skipped it. Remember? Well, that's what I'm saying. I mean, he'll get Shade Soul here. He'll, he'll kill it, and then it's it's not really too far out of the way now to go get the second one. That is true. Mister Surbai and Shamans. Please go buy Life Blood Heart, and a Charm oh. Notch, and Steady Body. Yeah, I think he was looked like he was trying to do some math in his head there about what he needed. He only got lifeblood heart, right? I saw that right. I think so. I think you're right. Oh man. Oof. Python. Yep, he gets the kill. He's gonna get yeah. So two soul warriors is all but um, pythons right now. Yeah, Sirs can get sniped on this. Is Which he is going so for sad. it even? Yeah, he's gonna go by Elgin Key. Otherwise, you would have bought Steady Buddy. Oh, and th yeah, this actually kind of hurts to spend 800 on it right now. Oh, he's not gonna. He's gonna get heavy blow. Did he buy Steady Buddy? Did he buy Steady? He did. Yeah, he did. Okay. How did I miss that? Oh, my. Is Mr. Sir big braining us right now? Skipping Elegant Key is something. I honestly don't know what made him do that. Right side city. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I mean, again, I'm, I'm sure he's got something up his sleeve. He didn't make it to grand finals by not knowing what he's doing. Yes. Ooh, it's going well, Dag. Yeah, We're not going to see Soul really Warrior. Well oh, he heals. You know, and now he's got Shade Soul and D-Dark. I can't this imagine player of Python dead. still. Yeah. Yeah. And there's the two Soul Warriors. Let me make sure that shows up. Whoops, there we go. Mr. Sir has a good idea of what's going on right now, too. Um, it's funny, because every goal that we talked about, Mr. Oh, Mr. Sir should prep this and he should get it. And then it's like, well, Python went and got it. And Mr. Sir, it's like, he just seems to be a step ahead. Mm -hmm. And Python's not saying Python's still in a good spot. Python's in a really good spot still. I think this is a very even match still, but... Keep in mind, he does have a little more prep on other goals. Um, Who does? I'm Mr. Sir, because he has uh, yeah. Jonies and a little more money and I think something else I forgot. Let's see, is Sir yeah, going to go I... straight for Emilicia is my question here. Because it's like the next yeah. most rushable goal from where he is. Right, and that center square does give him a lot of uh, a lot of power. Yep. We'll see where he goes. Could be luring in for a block. He does have a key. Do you think he's going to go waterways here? He could. Fluke nest for your row, but... I don't know. Ooh. Python's right behind him now. Let's too. see where Python goes. Python have... might also drop down to... Emilicia or where think? follow. He's going to Basin. Yep. So he'll get Emilicia and the Grubs prepped. Which... And Sir did open waterways on the other screen, too. Yep. 
Where is Sir going here? Mm, what are we missing here? Did he forget to open up the lem? Oh my god, did he? It, it oh, must that would be, be that. That would actually be tragic. No, at this point, man, just just go do take the elevator. You would have yep. been up there already. Okay, whatever. Okay. Show your swag. Python, straight yeah. down militia, right? Actually, I did like, not yeah. look at where he is. Yeah, he's in waterways, and I gotta be honest, this re this really hurts, Mister Sir. Like really, really badly that he had to go around and do rafters a second. If he time. went straight to waterways, he's not Wait, going on militia. He's going yeah, to the lever, nest. lever's open. Wait, the lever's open. Why didn't he? I have no idea. So, what just, what just happened? Whoa! Like, I don't know what's going on on Mister Sir's side. What's happening on Python's is he's blocking that bingo right now by prioritizing yeah. flukes. Absolutely. Yeah, and I gotta be like. <laughs> I, that's gonna be the first thing that I'm gonna just confidently call was just a mistake from Sir. I I'd have to agree. I can't really see. Like, it yeah, like I I'm pretty sure I watched and the lever was on the left side when he came through there. I'm just like. Now he's going for probably deep nest synergy, and fragile heart, greed, strength. Yeah. That's the only You'll thing probably, I see. Oh, oh go me up. Go oh, yes. you gotta prep this. Yeah. This is a strong play. Python's gonna block yeah. his bingo. Yeah. First try, fluke. Oh, it's actually fluke nest. Whoops. Yeah, I'll have to ask Mr. Sturpo that at some point, because I'm very confused about why he went through rafters again, but yeah. And there's a he's blocked. Yeah, so three bingos from that center square have been blocked now. Yep. Yeah, here comes Mr. Sir is going to buy out Leggy. Can you imagine? If Sir, mm. like, prepped it properly, row one is delicious. <laughs> yeah, I mean. He'll have the first goal now. He'd have to do Dark Jonies. Unless he, well, he, no, he doesn't have money right now, but he could get another 110. Yeah, I, I, I actually like that call, OJ. I wouldn't be surprised to see it. And it looks like he's going to head towards, like, Deep Nest now. I like the Demon's play a lot, actually. Hundred like percent, yeah. Python's gonna go get wings. Oh. No, oh, he's going Ismas. Oh yeah. Yeah, and we we talked about that. Python likes Isma. Why is he not getting enough distance there? That's very strange. He's not. He's po going too high. I've I've just never seen this before. Yeah, he's gonna quit out. Okay. Wow. That's gonna be some time loss there. Unfortunate for Python. He hasn't talked to Emilicia yet either, so he'll go get that. Yeah, I, I wonder what he's trying to do here. Let's Shade, know. the he's diagonal go will back be to a, the diagonal will be a lot more appealing without Markoth. I do like Hive Knight though. Yeah, I, I gotta even like be Hive like, for this play. <laughs> yeah, especially because he has. If if we think he's go, if he's going to deep nest like we think he is, he'll be there to get tram pass. Definitely is. Yeah. He gets tram pass, deep nest, stag. Callers what prep. does Python want Ismos for so badly here? Uh, it's not Ismos. It's talk to Emilicia and the three grubs in waterways. Ah, uh, so it preps gotcha. the bingo that he's close to. Gotcha. Also, yeah, he, okay. he likes getting the Ismos, Ismos particles, like the perma Ismos <laughs> particles. Yeah. Hey, he'll go talk to Emilicia now. Mr. Sergo and Deep Nest. He's gonna grab Spore Shroom on the way. Oh, cause just to get charms to buy charm notches, maybe. Yep. From Sally. There's talk to Emilicia. Yeah. So Mr. Sir here has a probably has a pretty good idea what's going on. Mr. Uh, Python probably can infer that, hey, if Mr. Sir went back to Fungal to get buy out Leg Eater, he's probably going to go into Deep Nest. So both players probably have a relatively decent idea of what each other's doing. Python is going to go with Ismos Ismo now, too. I don't hate it while you're here. What do you do if you're Python, though? To What do you mean? How do you counter this play, the Deep Nest play? Because it's Oh, strong. I don't know if you do. It's real. This is really strong. And one thing, we, we've seen Mr. Sir do this time and time again is he loves to put line pressure on a specific row or column and then go something do something completely different yep based on our like rules he, the opponent has to get it no matter what so it's just time sync for them 
Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. He does a really good job of that. Like, mm-hmm. he, he puts his opponents in a spot where he's like, I know they need to go play defensively against me right now. And uh, while they're wasting all that time, I'm going to go do other stuff and prep yep. other goals and get ready. It's, 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 ri- I think it can be risky at times, but it's gotten him this far. So who am I to complain? I don't know if it was now a pivot th- or not, but I'm really happy with Sir's play to go to deep nest here. Yeah, I love it. I, th- I think it's the right call. Given the goals that are on the board, yeah. I mean, Python's not going to get Markoth before, is he? He is going to go for Lurian, which probably means going for row five. Maybe. Yeah, the one thing with Lurian, it's a lot of time here. No, he does have D Dark, so oh, he's going to quit out. What did he just see that he doesn't like? He's going to go back Deep to Dark Synergy. I think he sees call. Or Mr. Sir one. could die here, though. He's got to be real careful. He's fine. Okay. Yeah, he's fine now. I actually now went up and grabbed the lifeblood here because it's faster than healing in my last room match. Yeah. He's going to go through here with two health, which should be fine. It's all fine until you get hit two times, but, you know. <laughs> Ex- <laughs> excellent analysis, yes. <laughs> Python grabbing... I want to know what he saw that made him just want to quit out of going to Lurian. Like he too. invested quite a bit of time into going there. It, it almost I feel like I should like open up down. a notepad. I feel like he's going like for ask... what, three notches? Maybe? That's the only thing that... Yeah, this this feels like a three notch play, right? Yeah. Mr. Sir knows the damage tanks here. Nice. As a low percent runner, he knows that that's the optimal way to get through there. And you can just bench on the tram. Is he going to Hive now or is he going to Basin, do you think? Probably Basin. Yeah. We'll see. Python is going in for... Yeah, he's going to go get the charm notch here. Yeah. <laughs> the two big questions I need to make sure I remember asking after this match. If well, I don't know if we're going to do an interview in between matches, but one, Mr. Sir's whole thing with going through Raptors a second time, and two, Python just quitting out of Spire Climb. Yeah. Those are my two big, like, what was going on. I, my guess with the spire climb is python looked at the board saw fragile heart greed strength and realized that sir has a lead on notches yeah and he really That's wants true. this goal for he is gonna go to high no he's not going to hive okay <laughs> he's Why just going out he's going to... maybe you can fully prep it from this side it's not terrible yeah. but also I kind of like deep nest. I guess he's worried about stopping Did that, Python, bro. Python went and got the charm notch, right? I looked away for a sec. He got it, yeah. Okay, I was gonna. I can't imagine he would bail out. I think he'll, he'll probably get the grub here too. Yep. Oh, uh, doing this. This is kind of a difficult skip. Yeah, just grab Isma's and never mind. Just, okay. just ignore me. <laughs> Classic. <laughs> <laughs> like I said before, that's why we're commentating and they're here. Yeah, in I need to stop applying my skill issue to their gameplay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad you like it, Pump. Mr. Sir hitting the C dash across. Very hype, very swag. Yeah, I think Python, not Python, Sir is pivoting for three waterways grubs to block this line that I'm just scared of. Oh, CG2 Markoth, yeah. Yeah, I'm not scared of it because Markoth is slow, but this is Python we're right. talking about. He does weird, some weird stuff. And now Python's going to get Vengefly King, Massive Moss Charger, and oh. Yeah, Python's looking Ooh. really strong on that. Yeah, pi- yeah, Python's got some scary lines he can start pressuring. Sir's going to have to get Dreamgate. Yep. You have to do something. Dreamgate's Python's the only gonna real have to not die. <laughs> Yeah. Well, he has enough charms that he can probably go by two notches, but he's got to do that fast enough that... Who, Mr. Sir? Yeah. Yeah. Did I say Python? Not gonna quit out here. Interesting. There's MMC VK VFK. If he's not quitting out, he's gonna go get the last waterway scrub right now. Yeah, I think you're right. <laughs> no weird Python rules today, Gaffy. <laughs> you want to mark that goal on the board? 
Yeah, yeah. Sweet. It's technically marked. I just have to alt tab so that it actually shows up. Oh, it's not. I see. I see. I see. Yeah. I I understand fully now. Yes. Oop, Mr. Sir having some trouble here. Can't blame him. These enemies suck. Yep. There you go. Everyone knows that all waterways enemies suck except for pill flips. That's true. And where's Python heading here? He's going to pick up journal. Okay. I don't hate this while you're going by it. Mm -hmm. Could he go could he go snipe gome journal entry? Go and Gar well no, he would need Garpede too. Yeah. Which I wouldn't be surprised to see him head to deep. Actually, I kind of would. Never mind. He's already going. Yo, I'm going to be super honest here. I don't even remember where Garpede journal entry is. You know where uh, Sharp Shadow is? Okay. Gotcha. You go. Yep. Now I remember. The moment you said it, I'm like, oh, yeah, it's down there. Uh, what Where's is Sir going? going? Fireball them. You didn't open up this side, bud. You got to go all the way around the top. Yeah, he doesn't look too happy about it. Python's going to go get his third notch here. Which yep. means Dreamgate Lurian. Yeah, that's some pressure there. It makes me wonder even more why he backed out of Lurian. He backed out of Lurian because he knew that if he showed off the uh, row five too soon, Sir would just counter it. mind games. Yeah. And, and here's the thing. If it does come down to a race to Lurian Dreamgate, Python's just going to win. He's got the damage. I mean, he's... Well, it's tough to tell. It depends on what Sir does. I mean, both of them are miles away from Dreamgate. Yes. Neither of them have any essence. Yeah. Python didn't go get third charm notch. No, he's on his way. He's going to go to Salubra. Oh, I thought he would go fight ogres. He fought ogres. That's his second. Oh, I, I'm too busy watching Sir over here then. And that's why we have two commentators for this tournament. Yep. And yeah, Chad telling me that someone marked a goal and I need to go back and forth. No, you're good. Thank you, Hardcore. And I kind of like Python's position a lot here. <laughs> like I, I I'm uh, it's very hard to counter that Spirit. dream gate is just brutal. Yeah, and especially Sir's with... so out of the way for it. Why are we fighting Nosk? Oh, the grub. Nosk. grub, 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 grub. Every time. Oh, okay, he's not gonna fight. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I, I, th I gotta be honest. Once you see the three charm notches, if you're Mister Sir, I think you start shitting your pants a little bit because. I'd say you Quinn will go Lurian, but he's not in a position he can't because he goes straight back to Tram. And he knows that Python has at least Shade Soul. He, he might not know about D-Dark, but he knows Shade Soul 100%. He also knows he has D-Dark, though, so that fight's still fast. Who knows he has D-Dark? What? Well, Sir knows that he himself has D-Dark. Oh, that's right. Yes, they both got it. Yeah. Is he? He's going to do Dark Deep Nest here. Is he going to go to unlock Stag? No, he's trying to. Okay. It's gotta he's be trying to go unlock stag. deepness. Um, and okay. Python straight to Lurian. Yeah, I I don't know how you stop what? this now. This we might. Oh, have he's grabbing Geo point. for the stag. Oh, Mister Sir, no! That's like the worst thing that could have happened. I'd agree with you. I could see it. Oh, I I just I know these rooms inside and out so well oh did sir skip d dark whoops forgot about that yeah yeah sir he just went right to resting grounds that's why i was confused when you were saying that I'm like yeah he doesn't have any damage he was like one room away he practically he doesn't know where he is either or maybe he does python heading t to deep nest interesting i don't really understand the logic here maybe maybe he's he, he, he knows that Mr. Sir has got to go play defensively. I think he's worried about blocking row one right now. He could just, I mean, yeah, I guess he's worried about getting Dreamgate in time, maybe. You have any idea where Sir is, by the way? You're the one who kind of knows yep. these things. He's, uh, this is the route. If you, if you go up to oh, the left here, that's where Galleon is. Yep. I've, I've been watching intently and just assuming you were watching the right side, honestly. <laughs> 
I'm like, I'll keep people informed on what's going on in Dark Deep Nest here. Do you think he gets the lifeblood before the fight? Nope. Why fight Galley? I mean, is he dream thinking gate. this is going to come down to a Dream Gate race? Yep. It and could. if Python were to rush That's a double. Call row five, then yeah. Sir loses. He's got a prep yeah, Dream he... Gate. I now, think even right now, still, if Python rushes it, I don't think he can be stopped. I don't think that's what Python's doing. Unless he's, for some reason, taking Tram to Basin, he is here to block row one. I think, he yeah, knows absolutely. He doesn't have money for Deep Nest Stag. Well, I guess maybe he does by the time he gets there, but Kahlo's out's locked out. Fountain Vessel is far. Python's he's locked out of Kahlo's out? He's not, but he needs to oh, yeah. go down here to get it. Yeah, I don't think either player has saved... Um... Okay, Gome Garpied. Uh, deep Nest Zoat. Yeah, you got Gome Garpied. That's well, that or he's going for it. Go get it one second. Yep, there it is. Man, not a not a good spot for Mister Sir to be in here. Yep, at this point, it's row one, or I, row one or bust. I mean. This board came down to, I feel like Mr. Sir prepped a lot of goals like halfway that just he was never able to really cash in on. Yep. Um, Had he gotten Shade and GG's Hut or two Soul Warriors? Yeah. Be a very it's a different, different game. game. It's a completely different game. Oh, and he and he's messing up this dark room a lot here. This is this is a tough dark room. And I th yeah, I th he's going all in on that first um, goal, the the first row. Beans, uh, go. he got you just, you just use your low percent knowledge. There you go. Don't <laughs> use the dash. <laughs> just, just do do what you know. <laughs> uh, he has Gom and he has Garpede, but he didn't actually get the journal to get the journal entry goal. Who? Um, sir. Oh, there yeah, are three yeah. required items of which he had two. Python, yeah. three. He, he he never picked up the uh the actual hunter's journal from the hunter. Mr. Sir, Mr. Sir, showing he knows his dark rooms <gasps> oh very well. Oh my God, well. Python! Yeah, you can't really heal here. Hey, he had to use his fireball to stay alive. There's nowhere to get soul. I swear he spent half this game on one HP, and he's. I know, right? He's considering yeah, warping Sir. out. He knows how bad a death here. Oh my God! Yeah, I mean, a death. He's not wrong. A death there is catastrophic. Okay, there's deep nest stag. Yeah, that was a just a time waste then. Go Magarpede is a complete waste for him. He's got to go, what, city? Go get Lurian? Nope. What do I, I know, right? tab out, by the way. Oh, yeah. I saw him mark it. I'm like, oh, he marked it. Where's Python going now? Maybe fight CG2? I don't know. He's going to... Going back to... He's going to go get Thank Jonies you. to block the line. Ah... Uh... And Dark Johnny, he already has Lifeblood Heart. He had to buy it to get the notch. Uh, Yikes. I, I, Mr. Sir not going for it. I feel like that's going to... That'll lose the game for him, probably. He might go with Lurian. <laughs> yeah, and even if they both start playing defensively and block all of each other's lines... Python has a three goal lead right now. I, I, if Python steals Lifeblood Jonies, I don't think it's quite resignable for Mr. Sir, but man, is he in a tough spot. Here's the thing if. He's Sir should have. Go get Spade Soul. Sir should have gone for Lifeblood Jonies. Just given the information he saw. Python, Mark, Gom, Garpede, and he got Deep Nest yeah. stack, which means he had further progression in Deep Nest. And that um, yeah. it was the right choice to go block that right now, because otherwise he would have been getting Lurian or Dream yeah, Gate. And you know he's not working towards either of those goals. And Python, Python just making all the right decisions in this match, too. Like He, he knows Mr. Sir's only real chance of winning is that top row, and he's making sure that doesn't happen right now. No, he is on one health. Oh, he might not be able to go get it. He's going to go heal off enemies, hey. I guess. Go kill this tick tick. Yeah. No trans, for trans, those who mark, don't, write that down. For those who don't know, um, if a, when rooms are dark rooms, 
Team Cherry just kind of doesn't expect that you'll go through it or try. So any of the checkpoints of progression throughout the room are disabled. So if you get hit by spikes anywhere and have to hazard respawn, you're back to the start of the room. No matter how, you could be six inches from the end of the room and you hit the spikes, you're back to the, the entire beginning of the room. So, yep. It's a lot of time for Python, but I don't know. What's Mr. Sir doing here? It looks like he's almost kind of just given up on that goal. Well, if Python spends a lot of time on it and can't hit it, then... Yeah, I mean, we know that this isn't easy. We've seen him mess it up one time already trying to get through. We'll see if it's the same situation. There's another hit. Okay, he's going to heal here, I imagine. Yeah. He's spending a lot of time to do this. I still don't know if it's enough, though, for Mr. Sir. How much Geo do you need for the fountain? Um... 3,000. Yeah, okay, so we're not even in the oh same Oh my universe. god, Python's 1 HP. I can't see a he, thing he, he's doing. He's going for it. I mean, yeah, no, he, he he's made it. it. Wow. Wow. Okay. That was a balls. That was a tournament winning play right there. It is. It, it, I think it is. Simply put. Yeah, I, I think that's. Oof. There's lifeblood Joni's marked. But the thing is, like, I'm curious to see what Mr. Sir's got up his sleeve because he doesn't seem like he cares. He didn't even try and go. Like, he wasn't rushing for it. He wasn't going for it. I mean, he's, worried about he's down game. now. Five goals to nine, I think it is, if my counting is right. I don't yeah. see, I, I don't see an I've, easy way back in other than snipe after snipe after snipe, to be yeah, honest. Yeah, he's going to have to snipe. Quite a I bit. like the start. Go get wings. Go kill Lostkin. Shade Soul. This is your your start, you know. Yeah. Maybe fight Broken Vessel. It's a lot of essence. Yeah, Broken Vessel is a ton of essence. Yeah, I mean, he's kind of got... He's, his, his hopes and dreams are riding on sniping Dreamgate right now. And that's a really good, quick, broken vessel fight. I would expect to see Python go up to Lurian now. Or maybe not. He doesn't really need to. It's fast and he's there. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. Yep. Yep, he's going he's gonna to go do it. Which, honestly, I think is kind of best case scenario for Mr. Sir right now. I don't know about that. I, I think... Well, it's it's best case scenario of reasonable things that a player of Python skill would do. Well, like he's either gonna go start prepping Dreamgate or Lurian, and I feel like you'd rather have him. If you're a Mr. Sir fan, you'd rather have him go in Lurian because that's a lot of time into a goal that doesn't really help with Dreamgate. I think that Dreamgate is something Sir is gonna be forced to do with this play. Like by our rules, he's yeah. to block all of the lines. And if oh, yeah, Python committed. then goes turns around and does four full Dream Trees, now Sir has to go all the way to Markoth. And with those two goals, it's going to make Sir do two super long ones, and Python would yeah. only need two goals to win. And practically the rest of the board. It's just... Dreamgate is 900. Yeah. And Broken Vessel is what, 400? Or Loskin's 400 Essence, I believe? Yep. Yeah, and he did fight Gorb, if I remember. No, he did he fight he Gorb? He did not fight Gorb. He now. fought Galleon. Okay, which is what, 150? And he gets the Lostkin kill. He's going to set up the Death Warp. Very nice. Yeah, Python's going to get Lurian here. So Mr. Sir does have quite a bit of a lead on Essence here to go snipe Dreamgate. That, that's really all he can do right now. Okay, up to 600. So he needs 300 more Essence. Yeah, grab wings while you're here. So what do you think are the two quickest bosses or quickest methods, I suppose, that he could go get um, another 300 essence to help him out? Um, Tyrant, probably. You have city storeroom no. stag and you have the whole way open, plus wings so you can go how, through the dive floor. How much maybe. is um, failed champ? 300. Yeah, you can go fight failed champ. That's there and available. That is true. It's probably faster. Not probably. That's faster. Yeah. I don't know well, where he's going right now. Well, assuming you have a good phase one, it's faster. Right. Uh, okay, he's going to grab this. Wants that journal. Yeah, Is I, I think... This tree? Yep. I think Python would have been served better going for... Um, what am I trying to say? Going for uh, Dreamgate first. Because that's a race. 
that like he need, but he might not care. He might just be thinking majority at this point. But uh, he's definitely way. thinking majority at this point. He's blocked yeah. all of Sir's bingos. He's just gonna go do whatever he wants. That is true. Yeah. Well. Yeah, and Mister Sir has to block bingo, you know, because otherwise it doesn't matter. Yep. Well, this is going to come down to how good is Sir sniping? Is that? is that? How like much essence is thirty? I don't know. I I feel like just go fight false knight or failed champ, right? Like that's the essence you need to. Probably. I mean, for the whole board, it's not a great idea. I mean, you have to do that goal eventually. Why? do it now unless you think they're doing it which you just saw him do Lurian and you know he hasn't really been doing too much That's in the true. way of essence yeah I, I just I don't know that getting the dream tree is a lot of time or the, the whispering root and I just don't really know what it buys you four full dream trees how have I not seen that goal on the board for the last 59 minutes I, I was how just, just calming <laughs> about it I was like, <laughs> how, I not, how have I just not seen that on the board I was like yeah he, he's either going to get forced <laughs> to do Markoth or dream trees you're Amazing. like uh huh <laughs> all right this is a fa this is failed champ here <laughs> how did i just not see that for the last hour <laughs> it's, it's like the one goal i haven't seen anyways yeah oh, man. Look at failed. i imagine the play here is failed champ yeah if he wants to uh, you always want to start this fight with full soul it makes a huge difference mm -hmm. it's um, gotta first try it yeah you kind of have to python can go do tyrant maybe this is best case scenario for sir if that's yeah. the truth. Oh, Python, um, forgetting he already got the grub. He gets all three doubles, does Mr. Sir, by the way. That's a huge opening for him in this fight. That's exactly what you need. Yeah, e each double is, is the, I think it's the equivalent of like eight nail hits or something ridiculous. Mm -hmm. I can tell you that they're each, what, 80 damage? Yeah. So how, I, I don't, I can't math right now. I'm too busy commenting. But Mr. Sir is a te technically, okay. I think he's technically on one hit here. Yeah. He heal up, please, for the love of God. <laughs> I mean, yeah, go heal up by all means, but... Uh, he's, he's only going to go to three health. He's playing it risky. And he's I, close. I don't like that setup. He didn't... He oh, didn't, my no, God. He's, you don't really do the dream nail after the jump unless you have... Um, Wielder. What do you call it? Wielder, yeah. Okay, he's he's okay here. How much essence does Python have? He doesn't have enough to snipe Dreamgate, does he? No. I don't know what Python's even doing. I need to look at this. Yeah, I mean, anything... This game is not over. I, Python's definitely in a commanding position, but, like, it ain't Python's over. doing grabs right now. Oh, there's the Mr. Sir I know and love. Hits the, the triple, triple, ends that phase. Yeah, Python... Maybe we get a Myla kill? No, does not giving the people what they want. You Wait, hate to see it. Python doesn't have wings, right? Python does not. Please have tell wings, me no. he doesn't. CG two shade skip. We're gonna see it. We're gonna see it. I mean, obviously, right, I'm Mr. rooting for Sir. a second match. So this yeah. is the only time I found myself actually rooting for Python. <laughs> yeah, for the C yeah for anybody who doesn't know. Oh uh, um, no, I lied. No, nope, I lied. No, nope, no. What's he doing? He's doing seven grabs, peaks. Yeah. Well. I, mean, oh. I guess my pull request to Bingo Sync still hasn't gone through because there is no area oh called God. Crystal Shut Peaks. Oh my God! Shut up, bro! You're so <laughs> annoying. Wow. There's. I'm just. I'm telling the viewers the truth about the video game. I don't know what Crystal Peaks is. No one weird. wants your damn enlightenment. Shut up. Everyone wants my enlightenment. That's why I'm here. But anyways, Mr. Sir, gonna get that Dream Gate and block that. <laughs> Amazing. And getting the pale ore too. Doesn't really matter, but there's Dream Wielder and should see should see Dream Gate in just a moment. Probably to Python's joy, honestly. Knowing like, hey, my opponent just had to spend all this time getting essence and I got to do other stuff. Yeah. So Python has four, six, eight, nine, ten goals. Yeah. He's got a big lead on twenty grubs. Big lead on seven grubs and peaks. If he actually does the CG2, one health, though. if he did the okay. CG2 save skip, he'd win. Like, actually. Yeah. If he did all three of those peaks goals. 
Yeah. The one thing I was going to mention, too, before stuff started getting hype, though, for anybody who wasn't here when we started or coming in, uh, Mr. Sir coming from the lower bracket of this double elimination tournament uh, and Python coming from the upper bracket, meaning Mr. Sir has to win twice, which is why, being very transparent, myself and OJ commentating, we're a little biased for Mr. Sir to win this one, not because we have anything against either player, but we would just like to see a second match today because we want the content. You can't do the shade skip anymore? Yeah, um, so what was that about? That was the only time almost ever that it would be optimal and <laughs> he didn't do it. <laughs> yeah, was that on purpose? Did he just forget that he has to, like, die there? I don't, I don't know. Um, he go probably hasn't grub, done though. the math on that. He never even considered it. He's just here for grubs. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Getting another whispering root from Mr. Sir. Is this his second or third? Python, you want a cast of soul coming into this room to deal with this guy. Yeah, always. Otherwise, this room sucks. Okay. He manages, though, because Python's a beast at this game. Mr. Sir looking around for the last little bits of essence from this Whispering Root. Yeah, I don't... I guess we'll see at the end of this if it's two or three, but... Python. He, did he already get the grub in this room? Or when you go... To, yeah, I think he did. That's three. Sir only needs one more, but I don't know what he does here. Yeah, this 10 to 6 on the board right now. Yo, you know... Okay, you know what I would be really hype about, even if we don't get a second match today? Is if we get a race for Kalos out. <laughs> Could you imagine? Yeah, <laughs> it would be pretty hype. Okay, Python going to get that grub. And that's the goal. Yep, that is... Uh, oh, is it? Yep, that's seven grubs. Yep, that's seven grubs, okay. Eleven go goals for Python couple now. More grubs and get 20. Yeah, that'll be 12. And he's, he's already set up for Crystal Guardian. I mean, he's a little bit away from it. Mr. Sir, I mean, oh, God. I feel like you got to get lucky at this point. There's too many different things you have to block. It, you have to block them all in order perfectly. Like, I don't know what you do here if you're Mr. Sir. He's going to go get this dream tree to start. The one to the left yeah. of Leg Eater. Mm -hmm. After that, I mean, obviously, I'd like to see maybe a CG2 or a Hive Knight. I don't know. There's no easy yeah. goals left for Python to get because he has um, to go get does wings he have any for relics CG2. To sell? Does he have any relics to sell? Python? Yeah. Probably not. He skipped a whole bunch over the course of this match. Yeah. Because I was going to say um, Fountain Vessel Fragment. All right. That should be four Dream Trees right there. Yep. All righty. Complete four full Dream Trees for Mr. Sir going on the board. Oh, yeah. Seven, Grub two. Money. You're right. He can just go get Fount Fountain Vessel. Yeah, he's going to get the 20 grubs. Yeah, he's going to go get in that. That's going to be the win, then. Yeah, the, he, yeah, that's that's it. He gets this money. Unless for and some reason he doesn't go for it. Does Sir have money to snipe it? No, not even close. Unfortunate. Yep. He could go sell to Lem. Maybe. He might have some relics from Essence and such. Yeah. And he would this this would bank on Python not just going and getting the goal, which, which unlikely because it's Python. Yeah. Well, I'd like to see him quit out at three thousand. Yep, he's going. Yep, he he doesn't even, he's he he senses he smells blood in the water. And I think we might be looking at Python closing out on his tournament run here as the champion. It's starting to look like it. Man, what a run! <laughs> but it's not, it's not over yet. I didn't see where he just stagged to. Probably Kings. Yeah, he, he okay, doesn't yeah, have hidden over. station. I don't know where Mr. Sir is even going at this point. CG2. Yeah. He saw the seven grubs and peaks, so he knows that Python probably has it prepped. Not much he can do. You're not going to guess correctly on every single one of these goals. 
Yeah, Mr. Sir would need a, a crystal ball to to win this match at this point. Well, at this point, I don't think there's anything you can do. You're or not just beating open my stream. The, no. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, I mean, even even if you could see everything right now, it wouldn't make a difference. Yeah. Unless Python like, unless his computer explodes right now and he loses his controller in the fire and he can't play anymore. Yeah, yeah. he's gonna wrap this one up right here. Yep. Well, guys, that's gonna be GG. That's gonna be the end of the tournament. Damn. Yeah, wow. And here it is. Oh, wait, you can't interact with the statue yet until the text goes away. So, Mr. Yeah. Sir, still with an opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well. Mr. Sir, or Python bowing in appreciation. And that's going to be it. All right. <sighs> Do we let him finish up this? Uh... Yeah, let, let, let him finish up the fight for the content. I'll stop the timer though before people yell at me. Yeah. I'm glad you guys enjoyed the tournament. I'll be thanking yeah. everyone in a minute here. Only four goals left in the entire board, so yeah. you know. We got the close height match we wanted. GG. Yeah. Yep. Let GG's me to both runners. I was so confused when you were not to get Mark and I was like, did I miscount or something? <laughs> yeah, yeah, they didn't unmute us. I'm like, we were letting you finish up cheesy like, too. <laughs> yeah, GG content. Yeah. Uh, GG yeah. indeed. GG. Yeah. yeah. What a run. Python, congratulations. You are the champion <laughs> of the bingo tournament. How are you feeling right now in this moment? I am happy. <laughs> uh, I am not happy with how I played today, like physically. Like, you know, press buttons correctly. That was not, that was very off today, but I'm happy that I won. Yeah. Great to hear. Um, you played a great match. You, you had good routing, good play all the way through. You gave us a few heart attacks being on one HP and sections of the run that no one wants to see on one HP. But um, yeah, you played very, very well. I think I could see some panic from both of you worried about each other's rows that they were pushing. Um, Sir definitely went about out of his way to go get Dreamgate for the block. And I think Python, you're on your way into Deep nest to try and get some blocks there for row one. Am I correct or no? Uh, I was yeah. So when I went to deep nest, I wasn't trying to get a block on row one. I was just trying to get the garpede goal and grubs, okay. and also find a G find geo to buy queen station. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, I I'm not gonna lie. When I worked to queen station. I thought he still didn't have enough. I was like, okay, I'm going to make something up. I'm going to kill Jellies or something. And then I went to it, and it's 120, and I'm like, Whoa! I thought it was 115. <laughs> uh... Yeah, so, so two questions I had strategically about the game. Um, so one, Python, there was a moment where you started heading up to Lurian, and before you could finish climbing Spire, you quit out and went to do other things. Um, was there something you saw on the board that you maybe want to block quickly or did you just not want to show Mr. Sir that you were putting so, pressure on that bottom line or what was your thought there? I was like doing Lorraine. I was my thought process. I want I see there's extra three extra charms. I have Isma, right? So uh, I can if I have enough geo, I can get by charms and get three extra charm notches. So I was trying to farm to get geo and mm -hmm. at first I thought Lorian, right? Lorian, a goal, Watcher Knight's Geo. Makes sense. But then I realized Vengeful King plus Massive Monster Charger is way faster, and I also wasn't having good time in the Spire Climb. So I was like, no, okay, <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> I'm leaving this place forever. And uh, uh, that's why I went to. Also, overall, Fuck Canyon was good for journal, uh, journal and for uh, to get to Deepness for uh, Garpede. Uh, yeah, go Pete. That makes that sense. Is... I saw yeah, that no, play, but... I don't know, so were you yeah. ever trying to actually push row 5? Uh, no, I mean, I got Lorian and was like, okay, now he has to do Dreamgate. I chill. <laughs> I, I I'm not doing Dreamgate ever in my life. <laughs> Python, you did ignore a fan favorite play to win the game by going for the CG2 Sage Shade Skip. Yeah, I was so, I was too scared because uh, I didn't bench in the dark room, right? And, and then I realized maybe I should do CG2 Shadescape. 
but then I was like, no, okay, grabs and C like CG1 for Geo grabs and then do uh, pencil is probably better way to do it. Better? Um, well, it's, um, depends on your <laughs> definition of better. My definition of better is swag. And I, I, <laughs> I mean, you, you saw me seeing, watching sitting at CG2, I was contemplating. Yeah, I, I, I was. It would have been cool to get all three of those effectively. What is it? The, the, there were mostly peak skulls, and then what? One, one grub is all you needed after that. Yeah, uh, I want. I just really, I really, I wanted to do one for Geo plus bench, so I don't want to go after like climb out of uh, crown. Huh. Um. So that's why we did to do one. And I mean, CG2 would be swag, but I'm too worried. <laughs> yeah, we, we were expecting to see it when you went to Crystal Guardian the first time. Like, oh man, are we going to see the shade skip? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, very exciting. Um, Mr. Sir, do you have any other thoughts on, on the match or what you saw or some things you were trying to go for in, in this game? I'm just, uh, oh, can you even hear me? Yeah, yep, can I, hear you. I see you just froze. Okay. <laughs> um, yeah, we got you. I'm just, like, still disappointed in my early game. I lost probably 40 seconds in Green Path, which is really cringe. And then I was, like, a room before Crystal Heart when Python picked it up. So, like, yeah. just the fact that it mattered. I skipped. A lot. Sir, I skipped, like, most, I skipped the grubs. Before the sea heart, like all the yeah, like exactly. the, I skipped uh, everything except shop keep keep obviously because that one is a goal. Um, I want to say there were a few other things. Like I forget what it was because it's but it was an hour ago. But there were a few things Python skipped to get crystal heart first as well. Yeah, we I actually really exactly. favored your position because of it, sir. Because you had prep on, you had more geo, you had yeah. Um, I, you, I think you had the key the stuff for that GG. Python sniped anyways. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Well, that's, yeah, like everything. Like, oh, well, he's prepping. I had kill prep on GG. Half the on the board. Yeah. <laughs> it was so bad. Well, yeah, that's... Like, like, you went out of your way to kill the soul, the soul warrior going to soul, ma soul master, and then that got sniped. And you were like, you had, you got the simple key in storerooms that Python didn't, and then that, and then GG's hot got sniped. And there were just so many unlucky things, but yeah. yeah. I didn't even see that goal until you met me. <laughs> <laughs> were you doing getting yeah. key for water race? Yeah. Did you snipe Flukness? Did you yeah, did you try I go for like, my name? No, I didn't even see you marked it. No, oh, but I okay. I just saw the like deep nest synergy and waterway synergy. So I was like, okay, I'll yeah. get that key, and then sometime soon I'll go to deep nest and get tram pass. And then mm -hmm. you were cooking on row four a little bit, and I got scared, so mm -hmm. I did that right away. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Did you um. Taking the time you were cooking for row four to put it into row one, I think you had a really solid chance. Wait a minute. Wait, did you guys see the the horn skip I did in yeah, waterways? Was I was that saying that was, was pretty sick. sexy. Yeah, I, I, I was thought saying... I did the the tram entrance to waterway. I didn't have wings. I C dashed into a horn and pogoed it up to the ground. Yo. Like I've, seen, I've seen that before. It's a thing. But I was just like, I hope this works, and then it. Did. <laughs> Good stuff. <laughs> no, I was commenting saying it was a bad idea, then you did it. I'm like, okay, I'll just stop applying my skill issue to your gameplay. <laughs> that was so sick. That, uh, you know what? That's like, I can take that away from the match and be happy, honestly. Good job on that one. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, yeah, no, I have to say, we most of the time we kind of did it, like, I, okay, I know I've sniped some stuff. You didn't snipe a lot of stuff I was trying to get. Um, I was yeah. kind of just, uh, I mean, I prepped one grub for grubs and waterways. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, and I didn't do a drink trees at all. I have zero essence. I don't have wings. I mean, I have CG1 beaten, but not for CG2. Um, yeah, honestly, had you sniped Fountain Vessel as well as CG2, or had gone for that first or to some degree, and these are the four goals left? This is like a real match because Python. I mean, good, a yeah, lot if, of if I could get to things. the end game where there were no quick goals, I felt really good. But I, w I would definitely go for Markath after yeah, if I, I get. Oh. I was just like, okay, I'm doing Markath, whatever. Me too, that's why I felt good. Yeah. Well, <laughs> he has dream game. Markath's going to be significantly faster for him and wings. Mm. 
Yeah. Every goal is going to be faster for him. If he goes Markoth, then Hive Knight, then Collector, then Kalozo, he probably still beats you. Well, <laughs> Collector actually isn't. Him. Actually, Collector isn't that much faster. Um, it, it really isn't. A... But um, I was um, if if we didn't get a game two, like sorry, Python, we were kind of cheering for Mister Sir because we wanted the game two. Um, but if we didn't get a game two, I was like, can we at least get a Kalozo race? <laughs> <laughs> Either uh, I even skipped Zote in Deep Nest. I just went I straight to Tram yeah. Pass and went to Waterways. I don't I know why scared. I was so scared about that square. I just like... Oh, it's because you were in Waterways at that point. So yeah. I was like, I need to go snipe this. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, I get it. Um... <laughs> it's over. Woo! Do we have a prediction up? <laughs> Yep, never yeah, running one v one lockout again. <laughs> <laughs> Until I ask you to t t tomorrow, and you're like, "All right, I'll do it." Nope. We have some more <laughs> lockout stuff coming up. Yeah, why don't you tell people about it? Uh, we're gonna be doing more hand brain. I think there's a lot of people who have seen this and want to play and haven't gotten a chance to yet. So we'll be doing hand brain with them. Um, the body chat has this? made several. What is it? new goals like 50 new goals or something to add to the board so we'll be trying out some of his new board i did a little bit of it once with python and one i'll say this because it's the only time i'll ever beat python um what else are we gonna do uh viz actually had a really cool idea that we're gonna be doing that um caters specifically towards him but that's fine it'll be fun but yeah i don't know what to say Oh my god. I, this. Hold up. I completely forget how to just delete a message. Can someone delete yeah. that message? Nope, don't delete it. I don't That's know. the truth. What I will say, thank you guys for watching. This tournament took a shit ton of effort. Um, it was cooking for months and months before we ever actually got it running. We, oh man, I can't thank enough the participants, and that's part of why I had this whole bracket up, because all of these people are to thank. CC, Sir, Dunn, Kara, Python, Zach, Hardcore, Loki, Viz, Gaffy, Fernie, all of them. Tournament simply doesn't happen without them. Rhino, you casted like so many of these matches. You, do it again. I'm glad you do it again, because hopefully someday I'll actually again. have a chance for you to do it again. Um, biggest shout I'm going to give is actually to Mr. Sir for picking up all of my slack. There were so many matches that were like Fernie matches where it goes till 9 p.m. And it's like, oh my God, I'm tired. And then I wake up and the brackets just updated and everything. And Sir just casts it or uh, restreams. He, he picked up all of my slack where I didn't even ask him to. He was just doing it. He helped prep the Discord server on like the first day. So big round of applause for Sir. If we can get some thank you sirs in chat, that'd be very helpful. Thanks, bud. Thanks for organizing. Of course, every time. Other than that, um, hopefully we'll have another one soon. I don't know how soon. I don't want to just be the tournament restream channel. I'm going to be doing a lot more Hollow Knight. We'll do some more random no hit. I'm going to be doing more speed running. Some balloons map making. <sighs> It's hard to get back into Bloom's map, map making. <laughs> Maybe when they make real tools for it, I'll do some of that. Right. We can actually copy paste <laughs> things. But more than anything, I want to thank all of you for watching. Uh, Given some vanilla lockout, some love like it deserves. It's one of the best competitive ways to play this game. I think the best personally, but I'm a little biased. Um, all of you in chat who are sitting here helping watch support talking about it putting your input in chat it really made this thing pop to life so yeah that's gonna be that i don't know if i have more shout outs for now thank you for the tournament of course thanks for playing and congratulations too i don't know if i actually said that yeah congrats bud thank you <laughs> um i'm not gonna play anymore right now but um Okay. Oh, yeah, I am going to take all of these and edit them slightly and then put them on my YouTube channel. So uh, oh, I will shout out my own YouTube channel. There we go. That button maybe works. If it doesn't, oops. 
All right, well, I guess we go find a raid, right? Yeah. Sir, are you staying alive? Yeah. Yeah, okay. We're gonna go raid Sir, guys. Alrighty. We'd raid Python because he won, but he's not live on Twitch, so. Um, I will see you guys another time. Um, I will not be streaming a lot this week because I'll be out of state for a portion of it. But other than that, thank you guys for watching. We will have more bingo coming up, more all of this. So thanks once again. Goodbye. Bye. All right. Bye. Peace. They're in your chat.